Have you ever thought about changing careers, but you weren't sure where to start? Well, News 9 found a one-of-a-kind company that is helping people all over the country test drive their dream job. Our own Melissa Maynard got to try out the service. Melissa traveled to Austin, Texas to see what it takes to be a music producer. On almost any given weekday or weekend night in Austin, Texas, chances are you'll be able to find live music of every style. As the self-proclaimed music capital of the world, Austin has more live bands than there are venues to play in. Hardly enough room on the dance floor to pack any more two-steppers into this honky-tonk institution. And where there is music, there are music producers. I want to hear this a whole step. This is David Murray, a music producer in the dynamic Austin scene. And I got to spend two days watching, learning, and doing what he does every day. All through a company that's only been up and running for three years called Vocation Vacations. It's an opportunity for people to test drive their dream jobs. So if you've always wondered, you know, what would it be like to be a photographer? Or what would it be like to own a bed and breakfast? or a dog daycare center, uh, what would it be like to be a chef? We uh, offer over 70 different professions. And Vocation Vacations has more than 200 teachers in 33 states to help you learn them. You can go to Portland, Maine to be a brewmaster, or travel to Santa Monica, California and become a comedian. Head to Cedar Rapids, Iowa, and you can learn what it takes to own a doggy daycare. We had a gentleman that was an investment banker uh, on the East Coast that went on a dog trainer vocation vacation and shortly thereafter he quit his job and, uh, and opened up his own dog training business. So to be a music producer we began with a blank page and a little story that David had just heard to kick off some creativity in the songwriting process. One of the mothers uh, has a little girl who in the morning when the mother wakes her up the little girl goes, Mom, just one more dream. And the mother told me the story. I thought, oh, that would make a good song title. So we just went with that. And with our working title of One More Dream and a melody playing in my mind, okay. we began jotting down some lyrics in a co-songwriting session. We can rhyme away with the fourth line instead of night with light. Then it was time to start rocking. Yeah. We first established a melody and a rhythm, and then I uh, established a tempo, 124 beats per minute, and then I laid down a, an acoustic guitar rough to that track, and then I added a couple electric guitars to a click track and a metronome, <clears throat> and, um, and I knew it was going to have acoustic drums, a full kit, and electric bass, and a singer. And after some editing, the song was done. One more dream with a Maynardish slash Murray byline is now complete. And now I know what it takes to be a music producer. On a vocation vacation in Austin, Texas, Melissa Maynardish, News 9.